it's like planting an oak seed. And if we expect to have the great oak tree tomorrow or the next year, that's not going to happen. It's the acorn stage for this newly formed Campbell River Youth Orchestra. In this initiative, we have to plant the seed for future generations because after all, we are playing music that goes back 300 years. The musicians meet once a week in the band room of Robron Center and the price is right, provided you are willing to work hard. My fee, what I tell the parents and the students, is in effect regular discipline and, you know, um, practicing their parts. In the future, if it goes, I can imagine that there might be a minimal fee, but for now, it's free for anybody that actually wants to, to come. I really, really, really love the trumpet. Like, I listen to Dizzy Gillespie in my free time, and uh, I've always wanted to be good at it, and this is just for me, it's extra practice, and it's so great to see the kids when I walk in there, and they say, oh, you did so good, and, and then I can know in my heart somewhere that they're better than me at their instrument, and I'm still working. Should we all try that? One, two, three, four. With the drums. While it is primarily a youth orchestra, people of all ages are invited to join in. I think we enjoy music perhaps even more as adults because we know how hard it is to get to where the professionals get to. The connections happen with the um, different people and I don't think that the adults feel intimidated because they're learning as well as the children. My hopes and dreams is to have a full uh, youth orchestra with all the parts, strings, cellos. For more information, you can contact the Campbell River Youth Orchestra at this number. In Campbell River, I'm Marjorie Greaves.